Hey guys, this is Bales. I'm at Fantasy Labs looking at the My Lineups page for NFL, which you can uh, navigate to by hovering over the sport and going down to My Lineups. And these are lineups that um, I've built. These are just sample lineups, but lineups that I've built um, in player models. So you can use the lineup builder, optimizer, or multi-lineup tool to build your daily fantasy lineups, and they'll show up here. Um, so you can sort by the site, DraftKings or FanDuel, and the slate. So if you've built lineups and they're not showing up, probably uh, you're just looking at the wrong slate. Um, and then you can also look at the at past date. So I'm on a past date from last year. And uh, what's really cool about uh, this, I think, is that you can see actual results. So these are the actual points scored on DraftKings for these lineups. And I think this is an underrated um, thing to do is to... Um, save your lineups that the ones that you're actually using which is really easy because you can export them I'll show you in a second right to the sites but keep them here um, and uh, and you can go back after the week is over or a few weeks ago or where, whatever the time frame is look at those lineups how many points they scored and uh, and really start to track things in a better way you can also see um, past points actual points scored within a, a lot of the tools and player models tools too so if you're building a whole bunch of uh, you can actually go to a past date and retroactively build lineups and then see how many points they actually scored which is a really cool way to immediately test things um, but you can see the lineups down here we have 11 lineups um, you can remove any of them if you don't uh, like them for whatever reason or if you want to change your exposure which is up here so this is the percentage of lineups that each player is in so we have cam newton in every one um, Devonte freeman in every one uh, these are the the top exposures you can click show all exposures and this is every player you have in every lineup and what percent and this is of is of course important in tournaments um, so if you're building 10 tournament teams or 100 or 500 or three you can you can track your exposure here and it's a good way to um, know which guys are going to be the highest leverage for you you can also see your flex usage over here so if you hover over 45 percent wide receiver 55 percent running back for me in these particular lineups and you can control that flex usage very easily in uh, in uh, player models and the lineup builders so you have your lineups um, here and uh, you can when you're ready and you have the exposure the way that you um, would like for the week click export one other thing you can also see so I have De Devonte Adams in a lineup um, we do give uh, alerts and they also come through the app if you sign up for that but you can get them sent right to the phone for guys who are in your lineup so Devonte Adam Adams is out get an alert and make sure he's out of your lineups but you click export um, and you'll get this file down here and if you go to DraftKings if you go to the lineups page there's a tab here called upload lineups you can click that upload CSV and uh, this isn't going to work for me because it is a um, a uh, past date but you'd click that your lineups would all show up here and then you could immediately enter those in whatever contest that you'd like so if you go to the lobby um, and were to go to um, contest and click enter all of your lineups would show up and you could enter them right there but uh yeah that's the uh, my lineups page really good just uh, just the ability to track exposure i think has a ton of value and we'll definitely be adding to this page this is certainly a page that i want to uh develop out even over the course of the season but um uh yeah make sure you um are tracking exposure of your players and and uh creating optimal lineups and then you can upload them right to the sites right from fantasy labs